Hi, third graders. Welcome to our third week of our project-based learning. So today, in our next step, what we're going to do in our journey to the moon is we're going to do some uh, research about the science of traveling to the moon. What does it take? How much energy do we need to push a rocket into space? How does that all work? How far are we going to have to travel in our rocket ship to get to the moon? How long might it take? These are all really good science questions. So what I'm going to have you do is much like we did the research on the history of the travel to the moon, we're going to do our research on the science of travel to the moon, and we're going to include that in our presentation. So for this week's assignment, what I'm going to have you do is do some research, and let's take a look at how to do that. So I'm just going to switch over my computer screen here. So first, we are going to go to our website on Scratch, oh, excuse me, on Google Classroom click on classroom and then we're going to find the assignment for distance learning week of May 4th and then we're going to click on view assignment right down here and now we have our assignment and it says research the website websites below find two science facts about travel to the moon create a Google Doc and cut and paste your facts with the link to the website you found the information submit your assignment. So I would go ahead and I would click on these links and explore. So I'm going to choose this one, fun facts, fun moon facts. And I'm looking for a fact about the science of the tr of traveling to the moon. So there's lots of facts on here. Like this is fun facts about the moon, um, about its atmosphere and how what its temperature is. It doesn't sound much about traveling to the moon. Um, Let's see, when was the first visit to the moon? Well, that sounds like history. Let's see, how far away is the Earth from the moon? Well, that sounds like a good science fact because I think we would need to know how far away the moon is. Um, let's see, how long does it take to travel to the moon? That's a good science fact. So let's say I want this fact. So I'm going to go back to my assignment. I'm going to click Add or Create. And I want to create a Google Doc. Then I'm going to click on the Google Doc. It's going to open up. And I'm going to paste in my assignment. Let me make this bigger so you can see it. There we go. Now remember paste is control V, but notice how it has all the coloring on it. So if I don't want it to have the color on it, I'm going to go to edit and paste without formatting. And there we go. So now it doesn't have any of the coloring on it. So the other thing I want to do is get the website. So I'm going to go up and copy the URL like we've done in the past, highlight it and press control, oops, control C. I'll show you on the keyboard, I think I can do this. Just in case you haven't seen it. So it's control, which is right down here. I'm gonna select the whole address. Press control C for copy. And then I'm going to go back to my document. And I'm going to go to edit. And this time paste with formatting or paste without formatting really doesn't matter because it's a link. So I'm going to paste it in and there is my one fact. So the goal is for you to get two facts about the travel to the moon, um, two science facts. When you're done, you see this button up here on the right, it says turn in. 
So you're going to click the turn in assignment once you've had two facts. It says our work is being submitted, so we're going to hit turn in. And there we go. If you need to make changes, you can hit unsubmit and then go ahead and make changes to the document. That's it for today. See you next time.